safety measures taken by cabin crew to ensure the safety of the passengers during traveling and flight. But before we start, let us know who is a cabin crew. Talking about cabin crews, those beautiful and pretty hey, ladies. Stop dreaming. Ah yeah. uh, yes yes. While most of the time we see flight attendants doing safety demos guiding us to overseas and serving passengers, they just simply not even a fourth of what their primary role is. Their role on board is actually too crucial that the aircraft cannot operate if the roster is incomplete. Primary role of flight attendants revolves around dealing with passenger lives and their safety. Hence, their responsibility on board is really huge. As the aviation industry invests a lot of passenger safety, the responsibility of flight attendants now entails evacuating all passengers in less than 90 seconds and being the last one to leave the aircraft, administering first aid to passengers going through medical situations, saving passengers in deep water and getting them onto life rafts and many more. And of course, last but not the least, ensuring the comfort of passengers. While emergency really happen nowadays and we mostly see flight attendants are focusing on service and safety standards. They train immensely every year to prepare them any unexpected situations. This is why many of get impression that primary job of the flight attendant are to serve meal and beverages on board. This is because we do not see and experience that what flight attendants are trained for while serving meals and beverages still part of, of the role to ensuring safety. It is definitely not their primary job. Cabin crew is fully equipped and skilled for protect and safe passenger in any unwanted situations where lives are placed on the line. So, we do hope that you understand how important the role of flight attendant is. It's not just about serving chicken and doing safety demos, but they are trained immensely hard to face emergency situations and to secure passengers' lives. This is the primary role of flight attendant and that's what they are trained hard for. Comfort and customer service is secondary, but safety is primary. So now we will discuss Stop! What? Please tell them what is safety. Ah, uh, okay, okay. So, as a gaming crew is the first line of defense inside the aircraft, one's being whose work is to ensure the safety of all the passengers. It's very important to know what is safety. The term safety is used to refer to the condition of being protected from aspects that they're likely to cause harm. In addition, the, the term safety can be used to refer to the state on which one has controlled the risk causing aspect, as protecting himself or herself against risk that is fully unintended. In short, the safety is condition or circumstances till the risk is acceptable. Happy? Yeah. So now we will discuss some of the safety measures taken by cabin crew. After boarding, make sure the passenger has switched off their electrical appliances like mobile phones, laptops, etc. because its frequency might interfere with the communication system of the pilots. And trust me, you don't want your pilot to be disturbed. That's right. Cabin crews also make sure to dim the cabin light during takeoff and landing so as to have a clear vision of outside as well as inside of the aircraft. By doing this, our eyes get adjusted to the darkness or light outside and we would be better prepared in case of an emergency. Make sure that the hand baggages are properly stored on the overhead compartments and are properly closed. Unless you want to take revenge on a passenger for not cooperating. I'm just kidding. Yeah, they also make sure that the seats are in upright position during takeoff and landing because most accidents happen during this time. By chance, if an evacuation is needed, the person sitting behind the recliner seat will find it difficult to evacuate as the space in front of him will be reduced. This will create an obstruction for the person behind you while evacuation. Unless you intentionally want to do it because the person sitting behind you is your ex. What's it? Yeah, definitely. If the person sitting behind was my ex, then I would have surely done it. Cabin crew also must make sure that the fire extinguishers are in proper condition and are not expired because we don't want our aircraft to turn into a screaming inferno. Relax, it won't. So make sure that the medical kits are properly sealed before takeoff. They are well trained to handle medical emergencies on board. And if they are not, they will at least give you full moral support for sure. Thank you. Cabin crew demonstrates safety briefing before every flight because it's crucial for the passengers to know what and how to use to save their life in an emergency. Like in an event, if the flight decides to become a cruise ship, 
make sure to grab onto your life vest which is kept under your seat. Once you are out of the aircraft, make sure to inflate your life vest by pulling onto the strings on the vest. And in any case, if you love to make your life difficult, you can blow onto the red tube near your shoulder. To blow, I mean inflate, inflate. And if there's any chance your life vest does not inflate, grab your neighbor and Onto your dear life. If needed, due to loss of a cable pressure, the oxygen mask will drop from the compartment over your head. Ignore those and have your nearest flight attendant to get some air. I'm just kidding, yeah. It's so only When we have stops, we may place that mask over our mouth and your nose. To adjust, pull on the elastic tab on either side. Make sure to adjust your own mask before assisting your pregnant child, another passenger, or your husband who is stepping at it louder than you are. Let's be honest, only for those who get rupees 300 to get any oxygen. Smoking is not allowed inside the aircraft unless you are like me or smoking hot. Thank you so much for your attention. Who did not give your attention? So thank you. Good luck. In the end, it doesn't even matter if you don't pay attention to what cable crews are briefing. So I'll simply conclude by saying, after piloting command, cabin crew holds the authority of several people. Hence, they have to be hateful and quick-witted to put his or her life first. People might call them stoic, but we call them the pride of the airlines. Thank you.